In 2023, the Art Explorer Foundation will inaugurate the world's first museum boat. A traveling museum will sail the seas and oceans, greeting people on every continent and offering them the best in artistic innovation. The Art Explorer catamaran will dock at port after port as people have intermingled on their journeys since the beginning of time. It will thus serve as a moving bridge between the many participants in a global maritime cultural adventure. Art Explorer, the biggest sailing catamaran ever built at 46 meters long, will accommodate up to 2,000 visitors a day. It will offer a number of artistic experiences on board, including a truly amazing immersive art gallery. The Mediterranean Sea, where people have been meeting and trading for thousands of years, will be its first destination. The Art Explorer Museum Boat will stop at around 20 ports of call in at least 15 countries during its two years at sea. Marseille will be its very first stop in autumn 2023. Several themes will be addressed in the course of this itinerant cultural project, focusing on today's major issues in the Mediterranean world, like environmental protection, human migration, or the fight against all forms of discrimination. In the immersive art gallery on board, a free exhibition will explore the representation of women and female artists in the Mediterranean region, from antiquity to today. Cayside in Ports of Call and in coastal cities, a cultural festival will be organized with exhibits, concerts, performances, workshops and encounters open to all and for all ages. Programming at each stop will highlight the local art scene. It will be designed by international commissioners in each country, in collaboration with regional partners all along the route. A temporary village will be set up in each port and will follow the museum boat as it travels. The village will offer a multitude of fun cultural experiences. There will be space for up to 10,000 visitors a day in a festive, family-friendly ambiance. See you in September 2023 in Marseille.